Hello Aquarius, thank you so much for joining me. Today I'm going to be doing a pretty quick general reading for you for something that you're not expecting, but it would benefit you to expect it. These are going to be general again, but if you'd like a personal reading, you can check out the description. Okay, so today we're looking at what's happening for you. you don't expect, but it would benefit you to expect that thing. Happening for Aquarius, they don't expect. What's going on for Aquarius? Ooh, Ten of Pentacles. Okay, beautiful. Show me more. Show me more. Ooh, Daughter of Swords. Okay, show me more. So there's something about building some sort of empire. Okay, and then we have the Seven of Swords. Um, and people could be paying attention to this. There could be someone specific that's like paying attention to something that you're building, something you're creating. It could be a family, it could be a business, it could be, it's like some sort of legacy, something um, kind of big, I don't know, something kind of big is going on for someone and someone's watching um, online, social media, or is spying in some way secretly um okay there also could be something that someone is studying and it's going to grow into something pretty big someone's keeping like big ideas to themselves okay show me more please for Aquarius The magician okay yeah manifesting manifesting something creating this ultimate abundance legacy empire type energy um, but there also is like a message about like some there's people who are witnessing or someone specific that's witnessing someone building something pretty big there could be like I don't know with the magician coming out it could there could be something about how someone's trying to manipulate the situation um, could be with energy. Um, there could be something where someone is like operating on out like under another name on a social media account. This would be something where like someone's really like um, active on a social media account or posting something or creating something for the public to see. There could be like people with fake accounts or something that are watching or leaving comments. Okay, so I'm gonna get more details of the other deck. Um, there's again there's a message though about how someone's trying to manifest someone's trying to learn something new or study something so that they can turn it into like a business or someone trying to monetize their passions or there could be something about wanting to create a family but I don't know why someone secretly wants to create a family or something. Okay. Show me more details, please, for Aquarius. More details about what's happening for Aquarius that they don't expect, please. Two of Cups. Okay, yeah. Somebody, like, found their niche. Somebody found, like, where they're comfortable. Somebody found, like... It even could be a person that someone wants to build a family with or wants to build something with, okay? Um, there's something where someone has like... 
they have like there's some union with their internal divine feminine and divine masculine energy like someone's in union with themselves like internally which of course could and will manifest in the physical as a physical union of some sort there's something where someone found like where they're going to be building something or like found like again their niche or like they found like this is my mission or this is like like somebody found where they're comfortable but also someone found that because they have some like they've created some union within them with their energies their own personal divine feminine divine masculine energies There's also something where like there's people celebrating some sort of success with a business. Okay, show me more please. For Aquarius. Um, there also could be like a relationship that's come together and people are like watching it and paying attention to it. Six of Pentacles. Okay. Yeah, there's something where someone's like secretly leaving comments on someone's page and it could be directly from their account um, but it also could be from a fake name with the seven of swords here um, see I'm feeling like I'm feeling like a few different situations because I'm also feeling here with the six of pentacles it's it's making me f and and the page of swords it's making me feel like somebody like put effort towards learning something new or studying something on how to do something or how to build on something. Somebody could have found some like really helpful information. Um, but someone's been working on creating this Ten of Pentacles, but the, you know, the Ten of Pentacles came first. So it's like the idea of the Ten of Pentacles or the want for the Ten of Pentacles, whatever the Ten of Pentacles is for someone like came before the like studying it and like manifesting it or someone is already actively like in this ten of pentacles energy and people are witnessing it and like trying to kind of manipulate the situation all right show me more for Aquarius please another six six of wands yeah someone's trying to take someone off their high horse or someone like there's someone who's like kind of petty in the environment that's witnessing someone be successful and they're kind of looking at this person like oh they're so full of themselves or something like that somebody's actually very balanced someone someone has actually balanced their energy has had some internal union of their own energies and is really balanced and it's like somebody is taking it as somebody's like um, prideful or stuck up there could be like things that people are trying to say to manipulate someone and kind of t like take someone down a peg there's someone who like does like it could be energy work, but it's like some work that actually helps people and someone's witnessing it and they kind of like, I don't know, they kind of aren't happy by the fact that you help people and that you're praised and that you are like you have all this like public success and people look up to you and stuff. There's someone who's watching that is unhappy about this. And it's kind of making me feel like the person who's like doing like really good work and kind of building on this Ten of Pentacles or building towards the Ten of Pentacles, someone who's really balanced, someone who has like aligned their energies, they're they're really aligned within. They're not even like paying attention to the fact that these people are around, that these people are spying or trying to manipulate the situation or trying to 
do things behind your back or take you down a peg or something like that. It's like this, the person who's being take, trying to be taken down, they're not even paying attention to the fact that someone's trying to take them down. <laughs> okay, show me more. Peace for Aquarius. More for Aquarius. Knight of Pentacles. Okay, so what I'm getting from this is like People are getting what they are manifesting. It's happening slowly, but it's like something's in the works. And with the Knight of Pentacles, it's the slowest night, so it's it's going to take time. But over time, it's like people are going to be getting like certain justices or karma. That's what's like in the works. That's what's being planned. Also. There's a message about continuing to like put effort towards your, what you're trying to manifest, what you're trying to create. Keep working on energy work if that's the case, if that's your craft, whatever form of energy work. There also could be something about some like malicious planning, but that's not something to make you paranoid or anxious about it or anything like that. But there's, there's, you know, I'm not going to not say it. There's some like planning to manipulate or something like, like someone's trying to do something like over a long period of time or something like someone's trying to plan something out. And it could be kind of malicious. Um, or it like trying to plan something to get someone to stop doing what they're doing. Those people will end up manifesting some unpleasant karma. Well, manifesting some unpleasant circumstances in their environment. Because if they're trying to take someone down, if they're upset about someone else's success, like what... What do they think that's going to manifest for them? You know, like, what do you think that they'll manifest? You know, they're going to manifest exactly what they're putting out. Okay. All right. So what, what else about this is Aquarius needing to be made aware of? What else are we needing to make Aquarius aware of for their highest benefits? The world. Okay. And the Queen of Wands. So there is a shift happening. Um... Okay, so there could be a message about something's changing with the Queen of Wands. It could be a specific character. Um, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. Feminine energy does not have to be. Um, it also could be alluding to staying confident. Oh, goodness. Yeah, there's a, ch there's a shift happening, but there's something about staying confident, or there's a shift happening with the Queen of Wands. Um... Staying confident and in your power and keep, like, taking action on your dreams and your passions or whatever this Ten of Pentacles is that's trying to be manifested. Yeah, like, don't let them stop you. Even if this is like your ego being manifested or something like that, like don't let um, the, the things that are trying to work against you stop you um, with what you're doing, which it doesn't feel like you will. And there could be something where something slows down a little bit, um, but things are changing. Things are still moving, even if there's a little bit of stagnancy or something slowing down a little. There could be something about cleansing yourself and getting back into your energy work. I'm not sure exactly what that's about. Um, getting back into some sort of, some practices or something like that, um, to keep yourself cleansed and not allowing manipulative energies to come through. Okay, anything else for Aquarius or Endless? Anything else for Aquarius? Okay, so I just heard you're on fire too with the Queen of Wands. Ooh. Page of Pentacles. Yeah, keep putting effort towards, um, your dreams. But also... Oh, I don't know. There's something about the Page of Pentacles that's making me feel like I just keep wanting to be like, don't worry about like the haters or whatever, the people who are trying to slow you down or whatever. Like their efforts are kind of um, 
useless here. It's like you're way ahead of them. They're just a page. They don't even know what they're messing with. There's something about that too. Like they're, you know, there's no like one's above another or anything, but it's like they're behind. They're like early on in their journey or learning about energy or something like someone's like behind on their spiritual journey or they're early on their spiritual journey or something like that. Like they're just a page, like don't worry about them. That's kind of what I'm getting. This could be multiple people. This could be one specific person, by the way. If it's multiple people, it's more likely like a manifestation of ego, really. Like if it's multiple random people that are just kind of, their ego is being triggered by you to trigger your ego. Like either way, like whatever it is, if it's multiple people, it's more than likely an ego trigger thing. Either way, ego is being triggered, but this also could be one specific person that like, I just heard you're feuding with, but it doesn't necessarily have to be. It could just be someone that, like, I don't know, someone that has an upset ego. Okay, show me more. Anything else? Anything else for Aquarius? Justice. <laughs> Justice will be had. Absolutely. Balance and clarity and truth will come out, and everything will be put back to place. Again, like what I was saying earlier, like things are in the works, like people are manifesting what they're manifesting, people are getting justice, people are getting karma, people are getting all these types of things based on like what they're putting their efforts towards, what they're putting their energy in, what they're using their energy for. Okay. And we just had Libra and Sagittarius energy, I suppose. Um... And then Aries, Leo, Sagittarius too for the Queen of Wands. But again, it does, does not have to mean that this Queen of Wands is indicating that one of those signs. It's just the energy of the Queen of Wands. Um, okay. All right. So thank you, Aquarius. Um, I kind of wanted any, anything else. I want to ask another message. Is there any other messages we need to share with Aquarius? I think that was the Ace of Pentacles. I'm not 100% sure. Is there anything else we're needing to share with Aquarius? The Devil. Yeah, ego. And what about this? Oh, goodness gracious. Knight of Swords. Yeah, it's like people are speaking to you through their ego. Okay, so it's just reiterating what I've already said. Um, people's harsh words are coming from ego. Also, it's like darker energies. Their agenda would be to stop someone who's doing light work that's helping the community, helping others, someone that's being praised, or someone that's doing work that they're meant to be doing, that they're that like their niche, what they're supposed to be doing, their version of light work. And of course, it's going to upset the darkness within people, whatever you believe in, you know, fit it however it fits. But the darkness that's in within people, the agenda would be to stop the light. So that's where the harsh words are coming from. It's coming from the devil. It's coming from darker energies. We also have, now we have Capricorn energy here too. Okay, so thank you so much, Aquarius. Lots and lots of love to you. Best of luck going through your situation if this resonated with you. Really hope it provided you with guidance and clarity. Um, yeah, again, best of luck going through it. And lots and lots and lots and lots of love to you as always. Bye.